building and the utilities around the site were, were heavily damaged. It was an empty auditorium inside Indian Springs Elementary School as Clark County School District administrators shared details about the damage that led to the closure of Earl Lundy Elementary School on Mount Charleston. However, no parents showed up and instead they held their own meeting. We're, we're, why, why couldn't the school district have this meeting at Mount Charleston where the, a place to meet was established? Lundy Elementary School shut down in August after being damaged when the remnants of Hurricane Hillary passed through the area last August. The closure was expected to be temporary. On a Friday, Clark County School District leaders said the extent of the damage includes the school's septic tank, electrical and HVAC systems, and damage to the roof. The district estimates the total cost of the damage to be roughly $6 million and says insurance will cover only about $1.5 million. A number of unforeseen, unknown costs, and we wouldn't know those until we got into the building and started uh, you know, uh, that process. Abraham Camejo, who was at the meeting and is a part of a committee that oversees future construction in the district, questions the evaluation of storm damage and repairs needed. So I, I question the real damages. Now, could things shift because of regular construction and making these cracks, uh, which they presented in these pictures? That could be just the basic facilities of the age of the building, but not, not necessarily related to the cause of from this flood. According to the school district, if the school closes, it would only impact about 10 students. Interim Superintendent Brenda Larson says the district will continue to provide transportation to those students so they can continue to attend Indian Springs Elementary School about 45 minutes away. Families decide to move their kids to a different school. Um, will they also be offered transportation or the parents have to be driving their kids to and from school? With the change of school assignment, transportation is not available. Many parents have previously expressed concerns the district would use the storm damage as an excuse to close the small school as a cost-saving measure. I brought up those concerns to the superintendent. When you look at the um, student enrollment at Lundy, it is low, um, but the, the storm Hillary was, was a catalyst for us looking at a recommendation for closure. 